Uh, hi everybody, um, today I'm just going to show you how to obtain the hope and read stresses from Apicus. So let me start with a part. So it will be 2D deform wall shell continue. And here is the outer diameters and inner diameter of the cylinder. So let be 40 and inner diameter to be for example 25 and this cylinder done is made for ex example of steel for which the modulus of elasticity is given in megapascal as 210 to power 3 so ratio 0 0.3 and define okay and assign this section done okay and then go to assembly create part okay and in this step just create static analysis that's okay and here load to be internal pressure out on this surface for example to be uh, 20 megapascal that's fine and let me also add some external pressure sorry external pressure of for example to be uh, 5 megapascal that's fine no problem and here is in the mesh create mesh that's 10 let it to be 3 for example apply it's reasonable mesh and here is create part and let me just change the type of elements to be plain strain instead of plain stress however plain stress can do the job but normally for cylinders or long tubes it is preferable to use plain strain instead okay so let us go to job create new job continue okay and submit this job for analysis and waiting few seconds for results so these are the results so this, this is the distribution of stresses von Mises stresses however sometimes we need to have s11 in this case it is sigma x x and s22 it's sigma y and here is s12 it is the tau xy which is shear stress however for the cylinder we usually look for hope and radial stresses so we have to define exactly how to use or how to obtain radial and hope stresses so go to this coordinate system create coordinate system it's it, it, its name csys hyphen one so this is number of local or created coordinate system you can create using a fixed system or three point but for this case it is preferable to use this one system following three nodes on a circle so continue and select any three nodes doesn't matter on the internal surface or the external surface of the system so now we have that's our direction and that is theta direction and that is perpendicular to this case so now we just created the coordinate system go to results option transformation user defined and select this one or choose from this list apply okay so here's if you go to s11 this is the radial stress distribution which is starting from negative in the inner side to positive of the outer side sorry to instead negative out outer side but it is negative 5 and here is negative 18 that is the hope stress all the values are positive and here is the bone misses stress if you want to have the distribution so create path node list add before and select for example this point here 
this one, this one, this one without uh, pressing shift, just click these points and say done. That's okay. Go to plot results, select path, continue. And here is that's von Mises. So if you ask plot, this is distribution of von Mises starting from the inner surface of the cylinder going this way to the outer surface of the cylinder if you just field and select s11 so here is a distribution of stresses sorry still uh, misses so just plot distribution of stress which is s11 radial stress which is negative uh, the inner surface and up to going up to increasing increasing until it reaches negative value because we used in this example external pressure however if you just use internal pressure only so you will go from this value up to zero so and you can also plot for example the radial the hope stresses apply that's okay and say plot here is the distribution of hope stresses which is positive at the inner surface with a high value and going down until it reaches also still positive value so this how to calculate i'm not sure if can we use you can just use one at a time cancel cancel go back to check this one the results of radial distribution of hope and von Mises is the similar of whether you select a cylindrical coordinate system or the default rectangular coordinate system